YouTube, YouTube, all in hand again. Now this video, I'm going to show you how to install an app called X Cleaner. Brilliant for iPhones. They don't tend to do anything for an iPhone, which is any good anyway, to clean out junk files. This thing works a treat. Links in the description takes you to here, Tweakbox. This is also brilliant alone. So hit get app, brings up a profile instantly, hit install, ask you to type in your passcode, so type in your passcode. Then it'll pop this page up. Thanks for choosing Tweetbox. Hit install in the top right. Install again in the pop-up at the bottom. And then click done in the top right. Then when it throws you back to this page, you can press your home button, move over to where you had space, and there she is. So we tap on it to open. We've just installed the profile, so it opens straight away. Remove the advert, press apps at the top. And as you can see, you've got Flash apps, App Store apps, which are you know paid apps in the App Store that you can put on. And most of this is back working today because I know there's been problems with Apple recently. Um, tweaked apps, Instagram, Movie Box, which I know people absolutely love, Spotify Plus Plus, Twitter Plus Plus, Tweet, but all sorts on it. Up to you. You play about with it. Um, but the purpose of this one is I'm going to click on Tweak Box apps this video and go down to X Cleaner. So here's X Cleaner in the middle. So you just click on it anywhere, click on install app, click install on the pop-up, then hit your home button, then you tap to open it and you get untrusted enterprise developer because obviously it's come from a third party. So we go to settings. We're already in here and I'll just back up and show you down to general then down to the bottom and you'll see profile and device management tap on that and then we find which one it is which I didn't check there you go tap the blue right in hit trust in the pop-up once done hit your home button back to where it put it on and now it should open there we go all working fine so at the bottom you've got memory status and storage cleaner you can just hit refresh here if you want and it just sort of refreshes your ram and your memory and everything but for the purpose of the video we will go to storage now the big red button where it says zero fill one pass that's what you want it on but in case it's not on that you can tap the button it brings up a pop-up pop up and just make sure you press zero fill one pass right now before we press start what we'll do is we'll nip over to settings Uh, we'll back out of here and we will go general about and you can see my capacity is 27.76 gig and available is 4.83 so 4.83 we'll back out go to over to X cleaner and we will hit start let it do its thing I'll speed up the video here right here we are near the end it's nearly finished now now it might not have cleaned too much on mine because I did download this not long ago earlier on today and um, just to check everything was working and to obviously you know so it has cleaned my junk files already previous to this video right okay cleaning has been completed click OK and click out of here and we'll go back to settings and open settings and we can see okay so 5.02 gig so it did a little bit like I said but I did use this previous and um, you might notice uh, quite a lot more if you've never used X cleaner before it's brilliant I like to use it about once a week so anyway there it is drop me a like if you would subscribe if you'd like to see more videos like this Cheers.